Hey guys, well, what's up? This is Cody from Hook in the World. Um, I'm trying this new sheesh out. It's called, uh, Socks All Herbal. This is my first time trying this all herbal, and I know tobacco. And, uh, it's alright. It comes in this pretty box. It actually came with, uh, four extra mouthpieces. I got two flavor. I got like uh, I got blue. I got bubble gum, which is this pretty pink one right here. Bubble gum, and I also got light or something like that. These pretty red berries, but uh, <clears throat> it's different because I. Hit it without a mouthpiece on it. Cannot taste it. I don't taste. I can get a small hint of it every once in a while. Don't really taste it. You're basically getting smoke. With the mouthpiece, see mouthpiece. You can. It enhances the flavor like tenfold. I've checked. These mouthpieces are not flavored in any way. You know. But uh. And if you look real closely, it might. The mouthpieces do not fit in my hose. So I have it taped. Don't get the best clouds off them either. You know, you get okay smoke, not the best smoke. See? But uh, bubblegum's alright. Got like a towards like the end of it after you exhale it after you get the main flavor you get like a perfume flavor. It does have a hint of bubble gum in it sometimes. Sometimes not. Sometimes it's different. You guys have tried all herbal hishisha? Tell me about it. Tell me your experience about it. Tell me if you liked it, if you didn't like it. I'm actually looking at the ingredients of it. It's all the same except for new tobacco. I thought personally it'd have something special in it, something different. Here, I'll even read off the ingredients of the bubblegum. It is molasses plus flavor. That's it. Has zero nicotine, zero tar. It's 50 gram. If you look at it, this really cool sticker on it. I guess people are, uh, copying their shit. It's kind of cool. It has a little hookah on it and a little shit in the bag. It's socks. It's pretty. Box all pretty, too. <coughs> <coughs> the packaging. She comes in all pretty. Airtight bag. And she shoots in a little Ziploc bag. Smells good though. Fucking smells great. I'm actually getting quite a collection of different shishas <clears throat> I've sitting around. Got chocolate, mixed fruit, mango, plum, memories. Light, what the hell you say that? And bubblegum now. <clears throat> All by different brands, mostly, except for Mango and, well, the two I just got are both my socks. The Mango and 
mixed fruit or same, <clears throat> or as they call it, cocktail. But when I ordered it, it said mixed fruit. I don't understand it. And uh, my memories and my plums the same brand. I was reading the box that it says for uh it says free for free for filter pipes. I can't think of a word of that better. If you see four filtered pipes, I'm like oh, my who gets filtered by water, by it, man. man. So once it's free, I'm like, what? See that without the glance of my hookah. I also got something new trying it. Arizona watermelon. I'm gonna put this in the face of my hookah and I am gonna try it out and see how it tastes. I'll tell you guys about it later. Got me my favorite cigar, Black Miles. I haven't tried this flavor yet. It's apple. Could be good. Got me this big ass stogie. Original classic, hand rolled. Big bitch. See, clouds ain't that great. Don't know why. Clouds don't really change when you take the tip off either. They get a little bit more thicker, that's about it. So, comment, favorite, subscribe. Tell me about your hookahs, your stories, about different flavors you tried. <clears throat> Tell me if you try any stuff I reviewed. Tell me what you think about it. I'd like to hear your opinion. Till next time, peace.